and brought to you by Sprite. It's the 2K pregame show. Hello, everybody, and welcome to 2K Sports. Along with Shaquille O'Neal, I'm Ernie Johnson. We're bringing you the Los Angeles Lakers out at Staples Center as they'll face off against the Memphis Grizzlies. And for the Grizzlies, they're sitting at 500 over the last 10 games, kind of treading water. They'd really like to make a splash over the next few games. Everyone is in their seats here at the Staples Center in downtown Los Angeles as the Los Angeles Lakers look to grab a win on the home floor. So for the Lakers, their last game a win against Denver. I thought the way they attacked the rim and got into the paint was phenomenal. It seemed like after a while, the defense just kind of waved the white flag. That's exactly what will happen when a team continues to attack the goal and come away with layup. It demoralizes the defense. Tip-off goes to the Lakers and the starting group for the Grizzlies. Conley and Allen are the guard set. Prince is the three and Randolph the four. And it's Gasol and at the center locking down the middle. Now here is Conley. Prince with a screen on Nash. Pass to Gasol. Six to shoot. And Hill with the block. It's tipped. It's stolen by Allen. Boom, he jams it straight down. Guys, that's simply superb. Ball pressure, a run out, and then a dunk in transition. Exactly, Clark, what they wanted, the aggressive defense to lead to. Yeah, points in transition. Yeah, that's why you want to make the other team feel uncomfortable handling the ball because you can get easy points out of it at the other end. So the Memphis Grizzlies able to put the first points up on the board. Nash dishes to Hill. Good, and the assist goes to Nash. Great job of utilizing that screen and finding space to knock down the jumper. Good basketball. Well, the Lakers have been in a bit of turmoil the last few years, and it comes back to not being able to find the right coach. Now here is Conley. 17 points for him last game against the Clippers. Yeah, he picked his spots in that game, too, Kevin, because I thought he, he not only did a nice job scoring, but setting up his teammates as well. Now here is Young after the Marcus Holmes. Bryant drives in. That's good. Kobe's got his first basket of the night. Well, some weak defensive coverage there, and I'm pretty sure they didn't plan on starting this game out like that, giving such easy access to the rim. Now here is Conley, right now averaging 17 points a game. Here's Randolph, the Lakers with the rebound. He lobs up the alley pass, and the jam by Nick Young. That's the epitome of teamwork right there, Kevin, on the alley-oop. Clark, what about the finish bringing it down with some thunder? Yeah, lightning, too. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll tell you, the pass was even better. He put it on an absolute platter for him. That's good. Here's Nash. Averaging nine points per contest. Dorisberg had a chance to catch up with head coach Dave Yeager. Doris, uh, what do you have to say? He said a big key for them will be containing Carlos Boozer offensively, adding he's a player who can spread the floor with his jump shot or take you down the block. And it's tough to match his strength inside. Defensively, they'll look to keep length in front of him and limit his offensive rebounding. <laughs> Sounds like a good game plan, guys. We'll see how they do it. Thank you, Doris. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for the Lakers. And the points they're getting in the lane will really help them open up the floor. The other thing they've had going for them tonight is their passing. I mean, doing a nice job. Plenty of their points early on coming off assists. And that one's good. Gotta love the use of the bounce pass there. Perfect feed. Here in the first, just under two and a half minutes played so far. And Nash, here we go. And Gasol sends it back. First miss of the game after four makes, so it's been a hot start. Here's Allen. That's in there. Conley with the assist. Lakers have gone four of five from the field so far. And the rejection by Randolph. Allen outside. Shot high post. Misses off the right iron. I'll tell you what, the mid-range shot is not the easiest one to make, but when you've got daylight like he had there, I mean, those are shots you want to make. I'd say that fast break went according to plan. Yeah, it sure did. A good job getting it started and a better job finishing it off. 
The Grizzlies trail by three. Conley kicks to Prince. Gasol is screen on Young. Back to Prince. Six to shoot. Conley into the lane. A rebound by Kobe Bryant. Carlos Boozer amnestied by the Bulls this offseason after four years in Chicago. They still have to pay his salary, Steve, but it doesn't count against their cap. Yeah, that's been rumored for a couple of years, and it finally came true, Kevin. So a new team for Boozer. And looking to bounce back after what was uh, one of the worst seasons of his career, at least statistically. The Grizzlies shipping at around 44% in the early goings here. Conley into the lane. Nobody near Allen. The shot goes down and it gets this game back to even. Allen's got seven points in the game. For Los Angeles, they've gone five of seven today so far. Nice shooting to get this game underway. And Boozer last season had expressed his unhappiness with the rotation in Chicago. He passed over for the younger Taj Gibson in the fourth quarter. Gibson was seen as a more reliable defender, though, and typically coaches default to defense late in game. Boozer, with plenty of motivation this season, to prove his worth as far as fourth quarter minutes go. Catching up on the changes for Los Angeles. Randall's checked in for Boozer. Johnson comes in for Nick Young. And it's Jeremy Lin in for Nash. Memphis also making some changes. Kufus checked in for Gasol. And it's Carter in for Tayshaun Prince. So timeout called here. The first for Memphis. And Boozer, a rugged rebounder and interior scorer with the ability to step out and hit that mid-range jump shot. Interesting to see how he fits in. And the Lakers with some changes. Okafor comes in for Jordan Hill. And it's Henry in for Kobe. Memphis trailing here. Outside Conley. Here's Randolph, and the bucket counts, and he's on his way to the free throw line. Try to make it a three-point play. How about that play? Great body control. Still manages to finish the play despite the contact. You know, when that whistle blows, you're not done. Get greedy and find a way to knock it down. You talk about players who either love or hate contact. Randolph, I think, is in his element, Clark, leaning on people. He likes to, like to feel other bodies. Yeah, they love Zebo, they call him, don't they? Uh, he yes, can get yeah. busy. Boy, I love watching him go to work. You know, he likes to be in the middle of contact. He gets to the rim. Whenever you lose contact, if you're guarding him, and he's not the most explosive guy, but it just points out that you can be highly skilled and a really good basketball player and not be a off the charts athlete. He wears on his opponent. Oh, doesn't yeah. Oh, yeah. It, it, yeah. There's a lot of attrition. I think he created that phrase on um, was a grit and grind. Grit and ah, grind for the Grizzlies. You're right. And that's how he played. Yeah. Now here's Lynn following the miss by Zach Rendon. The Grizzlies trail by three. Outside Conley. Feeds it to Kufus. Hits the jump hook. Everybody on the floor is hot. Incredible stuff here in the early stages. Tell you what, both teams playing downhill. Who's going to blink first? Now here's Lynn. A 14-point game for him in the win against Denver. Boy, he had it going offensively, just living at the line. Here's Allen. Kyle laid the pass to Kufus. Randolph with the ball. Now Okafor defending. Randolph can't hit. Lakers have gotten seven of their first ten attempts to fall so far. Excellent pace to their offense. And the shot is good. Sharp pass to give his teammate the high percentage shot in close. The Grizzlies trail by three. Conley into the lane. Allen dishes to Conley. Makes it off the glass. Conley's got his first two points. Boy, nice work inside. Tough to get that shot over a big defender like that. No, that takes skill and creativity, Steve. Uh, particularly on the release to make sure he doesn't get a hand on it. Now here's Lynn. He has five. And there's a whistle. That goes on Jeremy Lynn. That is his first foul of the game. And the Grizzlies with some changes. Lee comes in for Tony Allen. And it's Udrick in for Mike Conley. Here's Udrick. 
kicks it to Randolph. That's good. And it's Udrick with the assist that time. And it's seven points for Zach Randolph. That's the third bucket in a row from the paint. This defense needs to clog those lanes in the middle much more effectively. Yeah, and until they do, the problems inside are only going to get worse. Grizzly shooting 56% in this first quarter. An outstanding start for this offense. And Udrick kicks to lead. Shoots from the baseline. No good. So the Lakers will take it the other way. They just couldn't come out on top last time they took on the Grizzlies. That one was played in Memphis. Yeah, this contest didn't go well for them last time out. They played a very undisciplined game, got into foul trouble, and wound up not having the unit they would have liked to have on the floor down the stretch. Here's the screen. There's 48 seconds left to play in the first quarter. There's the feet to Carter. Five on the clock. A rebound by the Lakers. Well, give us your take on what Steve uh, just talked about, Clark. They dug themselves a real hole with foul trouble in that game. And one of the disappointing things, Kevin, was it was their leaders that lost control. And you don't expect guys that lead your club to lose their composure the way they did. You expect more of them. Yeah, you don't expect the mistakes we saw them make. They blow the whistle just as he gets it off. That's two points with a chance for another one at the strike. Really aggressive play, taking it to the rim against the big man. Tell you what, I love that fearless attitude. Kobe's checked in for Xavier Henry. The Grizzlies also making a change. Prince is checked in. Johnson, beautiful dish, and the layup goes down. Johnson's got six points. And yeah, they're moving the ball now. Eight of their last ten points coming off assisted buckets. Steve, nothing makes a coach smile as much as pure selfless teamwork. Lee goes in, and that one's good. Lee's got his second bucket tonight. And out of bounds as Memphis gains possession. Such a careless pass. You've got to keep your head in the game here. Here's Udrich. Banked in off the glass. Udrich has got the game tied up here for Memphis. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with the way they work down low. Well, it's become one of the stories of the first half, or just piling up points in the paint. And so the first quarter comes to a close. Both teams scoring well, but it's all tied up. Live from the Staples Center, you're watching 2K Sports. Monday, December 1st, Nikola Pekovic and the Minnesota Timberwolves take on Chris Paul and the Los Angeles Clippers. Big time hoops coming your way. Well, it's been a tight one so far as we get the second quarter going back here. And from what we've seen so far from the Lakers, guys, what are your thoughts? And you get a chance early on to see the